Joint Admissions and Matriculation Board, JAM, has accused the University of Abuja, Uni Abuja, and some others of offering illegal admissions to some candidates. JAM cautioned all candidates against accepting any admissions that are not provisioned on its central admissions processing system, CAPS. JAM's Head of Public Affairs and Protocols, Dr. Fabian Benjamin, said any admission done outside CAPS was an illegitimate admission that would not be sanctioned by the examination body. In the statement titled, Caveat Emptor, Illegal Admissions by Some Institutions, Benjamin said the attention of JAM has been drawn to the illegitimate admissions purportedly being conducted by some universities, including the University of Abuja. These universities have been reported to be issuing admission letters to candidates without recourse to the board. It is therefore pertinent to state that such admissions that have not been proposed, approved, nor accepted on the CAPS are null and void, and as such, asking hapless candidates to pay a certain fee for such admissions that had not been processed through CAPS amounts to illegality. Consequently, such admissions are illegal unacceptable and offensive to Eastern rules and regulations guiding admissions to tertiary institutions in Nigeria as approved by the Federal Ministry of Education and provided on CAPS. Continuing, Dr. Benjamin said in the statement issued in Abuja on Tuesday, April 13, 2021, it will be recalled that JAM instituted CAPS in 2017 as an automated platform designed to ensure that admissions are transparently done to protect the interests of all Nigerians desirous of tertiary education. JAMP therefore advises all candidates not to accept any admissions that are not provisioned on CAPS. By implication, any candidate who has not accepted and printed his or admissions letter on CAPS should not pay any acceptance fee as any admission done outside CAPS is an illegitimate admission that would not be sanctioned by JAM. It should be noted that admission guidelines stipulate that institutions recommend qualified candidates through CAPS in accordance with laid down criteria to the board for approval. As such, any such admission not approved by the board is an exercise in futility. JAM concluded the statement by saying, any institution violating these well-intentioned guidelines has much to hide and the board would not shy away from its responsibility of ensuring compliance to lay down admission guidelines. The board will not relent in its efforts to ensure that no institution violates the extant admission guidelines. Candidates are advised in their own interest not to accept such admissions done outside the purview of JAM nor pay any acceptance fee as such admissions will never be allowed to stand. From Lagos, this is Peace Mwabuku, News Express, Nigerian Television.